Hi, I'm Marcy Girl. Oh. So good. I think it's speeding, dude. It probably is. <laughs> What's going on, you guys? Mo Awesome here. So normally our videos, we have some form of structure. We know what we're gonna do. We know how it's gonna turn out. Uh, today is a little bit different. So we kind of know what we're gonna do, but we're not sure if it's gonna work out. We're not even sure what's actually happening, but uh, pretty right. I think I just need to explain. So you obviously, you guys, you see my bike and you see another bicycle and another mountain bike, but oh, hey. <laughs> Who are you? Hi, I'm RC Girl. I also have a YouTube channel. Today we're gonna do RC versus MTB and just freaking send it. Wait a minute. So these are not mountain bikes. There is just plenty of RCs. And whoa, who are you? Um, I'm Michael. I go by Mountain Mike on Instagram. You can check me out there. But so that's pretty rad. Um, I mostly ride bikes. This is all her. So she is RC Girl. What? Then so I am blown away and I can't lie. I actually, we've been talking for a little bit before this and I have used these things. They're insanely fun. What, what are these things for people who don't know? All right, RC cars. These are like adult toys, basically expensive, crazy toys. But we got a couple options here. They're very similar to mountain bikes in which there's a lot of different types. So you got your, I would say this is probably more of your downhill, crazy suspension, lots of travel. This is the Pro MT 4x4 monster truck. This thing is like a $1,200 crazy beast. What is going on here? So if you guys are new to the RC um, field, we got our motor here. So this is gonna power your wheels. This is a four wheel drive uh, truck. And then we got our servo. So this is a Reefs RC servo. And this is, turn this is the motor that turns the wheels. And this is a Tekken 1 8 scale motor. And this is an RX4 speed control. So that kind of sends the voltage, the power to all your electronics. And then we have a four cell LiPo battery. So lithium polymer battery, that is your power to the car. Mm -hmm. These things are like, if you poke one, if you guys, if you guys are completely lost, you're not alone. I just know that I didn't know much of the terminology and all that stuff. They're so fun to use. And so what are the differences between like this one and what this one is yours too? Yeah, this is a Land Rover Defender, a Traxxas TRX4. And this would be like the car that you want to put your bikes on to get to the trail. Shuttle so this rig. This is like an all or yeah, kind of a trail rig. Um, lots of uh, cool metal parts. I got some metal axles and some brass components. Similar to like real, real crawling, you want to Make sure that you can hug the terrain and some weight up front is gonna keep that front end down where you're oh, crawling. That is a custom, let me see if they can focus on that. That's a custom license plate that says RC oh, yeah. Grill. <laughs> <laughs> That's so rad. <laughs> yeah, people add winches and stuff to these and I got a sweet light kit from my Trick RC. This thing is super cool. And then here, this would be like your enduro mountain bike. These are kind of like your all terrain, so they have a little bit of speed, but they also have a lot of suspension and travel too. So you that's the one I, she let me use. Really fun. Crazy, crazy. So yeah, we're gonna take these out on the trail with some mountain bikes. I have to ask you, Mike. Uh, this one has your name on it, but did she just let you put a sticker with your name on, or is uh -huh. that actually yours? Yeah. So <laughs> she kind of got this one out of default. And it's officially my first RC car that I'm allowed to play with. Right. Oh, there we go. And look at this cute little one. This one. Oh, that was the one I got from Fox. So this is the 128 scale. Super tiny, but lots of fun. And let's play with these things. Ew. All right, so she's going to give us a little test. Uh, which one was this one again? This is the Axial Bomber. Axial Bomber. So let's see what she's got. Oh my God, these things are so cool. <laughs> <laughs> These things are so rad.
right, you guys, we're having a little bit of technical difficulty because I ran the camera over with the RC car. So <laughs> hopefully we can figure this out and I can shoot with this again. I hope I didn't break our camera because of the RC car. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we did make it to our testing spot. And I guess they're gonna teach me how to unload these things from the truck, so. <laughs> I think it's speeding, dude. It probably is. <laughs> it probably is. All right, so we're scoping lines out here with the RCs. Boy. And so I guess the, the goal is to basically have the RC send it first and then have the mountain bikers send it second. Just do a little comparison video. This is run number one. <laughs> <laughs> Not as fast as the RC car, but... could tell from that last clip apparently it doesn't matter mountain bike or RC car if you come in a little bit of nose heavy uh, it's not gonna end well I've been literally sending this like completely down I feel really bad dude That's I apologize <laughs> like I said she lets me drive For it durability so. testing. Oh, okay <laughs> oh still good okay <laughs> How do you feel with RC cars after mountain? Because for me, it almost felt like an extension of the sport. Yeah, I mean, you use the same terrain basically. And a lot of like working on RCs, working on bikes, it's a lot of the same. Actually, I use cycle grease in my diffs and my RCs that I use for my bearings on my bike. Oh, right. And so how long like have you been into the whole RC scene? 17 years, kind of on and off. Whoa, recently. I was not expecting that I know. answer. I'm old. <laughs> how old are you? 33? You're not. I'm not supposed to ask a lady what? that. What? So, how old are you? 35. No, you guys aren't. We're just big kids, basically. Okay, right. Never grew up. That's right. And but. so, uh, what got you into it? I don't know. I really like tinkering with stuff, and I had like an old Radio Shack car. It was broken. I brought it into a hobby shop, and they're like, that's a toy. And so, they showed me like legit kits that you can assemble, and I don't know, I kind of just fell in love with it, learning how the electronics work and souping things up, similar to mountain biking. You can just, like, what can I upgrade? So, so right. I and, have a lot of potential for that. And so your channel, RC Girl, how did that all start? Kind of, he liked RC planes. I was into me. super, I was into RC cars and he got me this RC car for my birthday and we unboxed it and I, that was my first video, my only video for like a year. And then I looked back and there was like, 2,000 subscribers, I was like, whoa! So, kind of found a niche. There's not tons of women in RC, so companies started reaching out to me and kind of became a thing. Another question too, I know like with women mountain bikers, they're always trying to encourage more ladies to get into the sport. Totally. Is it the same way with RCs? Yeah, totally. Like, people reach out to me, they're like, oh, my daughter, like, she doesn't see any guys doing this. Like, can girls do it too? And totally, I mean, that's you have all the skills those guys do and it's just fun seeing another woman do something that you you can see yourself doing it too hopefully with my channel i'm trying to encourage more women in rc for sure this is a world i did not know existed <laughs> but i am so stoked on <laughs>
unfortunately, our time playing with the RCs, well, I guess you guys are gonna have the RCs for a while. I don't have one, so see, see you Why later, guys. Have one of these? I know, I don't have one of those. If wink, only wink. Mo had one. If only Mo had the, what was the model? Axial Bomber. Axial Bomber. <laughs> I don't know if Axial's watching, but how can people find you? Uh, YouTube.com slash RC Girl. Thank you guys so much. Really appreciate it. Thanks. Woo. Oh, Woo! sorry. And if you guys are wondering why the footage is shaky, it's because this camera is officially dead. The RC car oh, ran it no. over. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay. It's meant to. RC, meant girl. To. <laughs> RC, girl, RC girl killed my camera. That's gonna be the uh, the me. clickbait. I'm gonna get <laughs> All that mountain biking. I can't survive an RC car. I know. All right, you guys. So uh, I've been playing with these RC cars for a while. This is literally my favorite toy. It's called the, uh, sorry, what was the name again? Axial Bomber. <laughs> Axial Bomber. So I'm not even doing a correct plug. Um, I did talk to Hannah earlier. Uh, she says that there's no room in the budget for an RC car, which uh, it's completely understandable. We have a lot of other things. I'm going to put a link in the description of this video to this car. It is really fun. Highly recommend it. In the hopes that that company is watching this video, we will greatly appreciate and use one of these. No, no pressure or anything, but... I am just shouting this company out, so highly recommend this one.